When it comes to our birthdays, many of us would probably like to kick back and relax when we celebrate another year well lived. But that is not the case for a 100 year old Canton County resident who instead of taking it easy, he wanted to spend it back doing what he loved to do working. Our Kimberly Kurt met up with Bill Hansen as he celebrated his big century mark birthday exactly how he wanted to. For over 30 years, Bill Hansen spent his days waking up and coming to work at Hutchinson and Cherry Hill. Well, I drove all over for permits and uh, enjoyed every minute of it. This career was one that started after he retired from his job at Exxon. He retired when he was 65. He's not a man that can be retired at 65. He has to keep going and going and going, just like the little bunny. The quick and witty man loved to work, and he did so right up until the age of 97. I love to come to work every day. And I have to say, I said it a thousand times, I never had a job that I didn't want to go to work in the morning. I was blessed. So it was only fitting he spent his centennial birthday getting back to the office. And I asked him, what do you want for your birthday? He goes, I want to work for you for my 100th birthday. I said, well, we can do that. So he drafted up an employment agreement. I loved it. I hated to give it up. I hate being retired. <laughs> <laughs> so I come back in here to get, get a day's work. And Fred's got to pay me a buck for being here today. Just because it's his birthday doesn't mean he didn't really get back to work. I had my replacement take me out to pick up a couple of permits. I went to my favorite towns at Cherry Hill and Pennsylvania. But they had to squeeze in some time for celebrating. Happy birthday to you. Hanson's lunch break turned into a lunch in, a birthday one that is, as dozens of employees and family members gather to celebrate the 100-year-old. It's just been great. It, uh, Yes, I, I say it again, and I'll say it many times. The likes of them have kept me alive. Going to work those 30-plus years, we've had a, a beautiful life. As I've said before, life has been a bowl of cherries as far as I'm concerned. As for his 101st birthday, he hopes to spend it with his kids, grandkids, great-grandchildren, and great-great-grandchild, and maybe squeeze in another day at work. I'm Kimberly Carr for SNJ Today. What a great story.